Hi there, it's me, Tefania Grant, mom, mentor, speaker, and founder of Girlfriends International. Welcome to this week's video. I'm so excited that you are here. Matter of fact, I'm excited that I am here. I am so honored that I can inspire you and encourage you on your journey to greater. Now, in this week's video, I really want to talk about the parable or the principle of giving and receiving. If you are one that always receive, then that's not good. If you're one that always given, that's not good either. You want to be able to have a balance um, in both receiving and giving. Now, let me explain. If you envision a tree, a tree is something that provides substance and it's a resource. But guess what? It received from the sun, it received from the soil, and it also give back to us. We can benefit from a tree with oxygen, with fruits, with paper, and it goes on and on and on. So you have to be able to be at a place of receiving and then giving. Now, God cannot give you anything if your hands are holding on to things. So if you are holding on to um, the things that you have received from God and from people, then you're not going to... Experience increase because you cannot take any more because your hands are full So the best thing for you to do is to receive from God receive from your community from your family from your friends And then give back to those who you can help and you can support that way you have a balanced lifestyle You still will receive or experience increase because God can trust you with the blessings He can trust you with the resources. He can trust you with wisdom. He can trust you financially because you are receiving from him You're receiving from your community and then you're giving back to those who need it the most So again, you cannot just be a receiver and you cannot just be a giver now being a giver is fantastic It's great. It's awesome. But guess what at the end of the day? you're going to feel depleted because you're giving, giving, giving of yourself and you're not in a position of receiving as well. So in order for you to give, you have to receive. Or if not, you're going to be tired, you're going to get weary, you're going to be discouraged, you're going to feel frustration, you're going to be overwhelmed because you're always giving and depleting yourself, and emptying yourself rather, instead of receiving from God, receiving from people, and then giving back to others. So I hope that this video makes sense. I hope I'm not talking in parables and you understand what I'm saying. You have to have a balanced lifestyle. Be a giver, but also be a receiver. I hope this video was a blessing to you. Remember, as always, stay connected to God, stay connected to your family, but most of all, stay connected to yourself. I really hope you have a great day. Matter of fact, have a fantastic week. Stay tuned for more. Thank you for watching this video. For those who are visiting for the first time, thank you so much. I really hope that you learned something or you, you are inspired to do something different in your life. And for those who are subscribed, thank you so much for your support. I pray for you. I believe in you and I encourage you. Have a great day. Bye-bye.